How's it going crew? This is Happy Days and welcome back to our Rufus the Rogue Expert Mode Let's Play. Got a few announcements before we start the video today and the first one is I need to say a big thank you again to everyone for the overwhelming support for this new series. I went in to do some comments earlier today and I saw the video had well over a thousand likes and I was just blown away. So. Thanks so much everyone. I know I, I know it mightn't seem like much clicking that like button, but when you're a YouTuber, you make videos every day, seeing that sort of response to your new series is a massive boost to your confidence. So, thank you so much guys. It means the world to me. You're awesome. Um, the next thing, uh, we thank you everyone for voting on the next series. So, uh, the voting has been really close and I'll just fight this slime while I'm talking. Um, so yeah, the new series will be starting soon. Not saying what it is yet because the voting is still too close. But uh, if you haven't voted yet, links in the description, take a second to vote. Uh, now this episode, we'll be fighting the King Slime. Uh, we just need to get an Extractinator, which we will find in the Sand Biome, and then use a Ruby. We'll get a Ruby from it, I'm pretty confident. And then we can pretty much just summon him around our base and throw lots of shurikens at him, so it's going to be awesome. For those of you wondering about the Yaren and Wolfgang special, they'll be out very soon too. I've been working on the Wolfgang one in my spare time. So lots happening on our channel, lots happening in this episode, so let's get started. Okay, we found another- Oh, there's an Extractinator! Yes! Where is it? I can hear it! Ugh. Okay, got it. Alright, Extractinator. Oh! Urgh. What do we get? Oh, Shoe Spikes! Oh, we can make the... The climbing gear. Wow, that was cool. Yeah, we'll take a piano, why not? <laughs> yeah, let's take a piano. That would be awesome. Now, we don't... I believe we may be lacking in the slush department. Um, <laughs> slush? Silt. Yes, yeah, silt. But we did pass a massive deposit of it in the, um, in along our journeys underground. So that shouldn't be an issue. And look, we'll still check back at base. I might have like 10 of them or something. We might get lucky. We might get a ruby. Ironically, it looks like the gold pickaxe has a ruby in the, in the pommel. Or the part where the axe part is. Um, but uh, no ruby for us. Okay. I just want to have a little... Little sneaky peek here. You never know what you're going to find. Maybe it's a killer wasp thing. Alright, there's nothing in there. Alright, I think we'll bail for now, guys. We got what we came for. Oh, hey, Rain. <laughs> hey, Rain. We need to expand our base soon, too. Let's put the extractinator here for now. Very nice. And let's see, do we have any? Do we have any... No mud? Oh, We have 19. 19 silt. Is that enough to get what we need? Oh, I hope so. Alright, well let's equip this. So we get some more movement speed. Always nice. And let's lock out the zombies. Very good. Okay, so let's put... Stuff away that we are not using right now. Oh no, don't put the ore in there, Happy. What are you doing? Ah, oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> Alright, anyway. Okay. So we have 19... 19 seals. Will we get a ruby? Ruby! <laughs> no ruby. <laughs> uh, so it looks like then, we're going to be chugging a spelunker. And having a quick ruby raid under the ground, which I actually think we'll find them pretty quick because Spelunkers make gems stand out really, really easy. Okay, it's time to... So I was going to say it's time to start uh, looking for the rubies, but it looks like Slime Rain has just started. I think the only problem is though, guys, we're not really ready. Um, I guess I can try and make a quick... All we really need, to be honest, is just like some platforms, I guess. <laughs> uh, let's see, can I make some more platforms? I should be able to. So, the cool thing about uh, 
throwing weapons is they all do piercing damage, so yeah, that shouldn't be an issue. Um, if we can attack the slimies from the sides, actually no, we can probably just... No, okay, so that's fine. Okay, so there's no issue there. Oh, okay, that's an issue. <laughs> it's like we're fine and then it's like, yeah, actually you're not. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, so maybe the trick to this is to keep keep the platform fairly narrow. Maybe. I don't know. Alright, let's build one a bit higher. Because I'm pretty sure King Slime can jump. He can jump, I was checking the wiki, he jumps 17 blocks at his best jump. So, he's a jumper. <laughs> But uh, I don't think killing the the amount of slime is going to be an issue because look at them, they just bunch up for us. That's it, slimies. Do your thing. Oh, except, oh, they don't seem to be able to jump through platforms like other mobs can. Like, um, zombies will drop down to your level, so do lizards. Um, yeah, so that's not going to work, but okay, this is kind of alright. And we can grapple around during the... The slime fight. I'd like to get down and get some of this loot. <laughs> Beautiful. Alright, and if I can actually get to the side of them, I can probably kill them even faster. Yeah, yeah. Alright, well, before we start any fights here, we're going to have to get more shurikens because we will run out otherwise. Alright, so let's close the door. Do I have... Okay, I've got one iron skin, one speed potion. Swiftness. Alright, unfortunately we can't buy daggers, so we'll just buy, like, a lot of shurikens. There we go. Ah! <laughs> They're in the house! <laughs> get out of the house. <laughs> Alright, if we can just get back to our little makeshift arena here, we should be right. Now we've got the campfire buff. Alright, so we'll just get to the side, kill lots of slimies. It should be easy. Oh, look at them, it's like a herd of slimies. They're like, we want to play! Rufus, come and play with us, bro. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, knockback. Oh, gosh. That could be deadly if you get caught in a bad spot. Alright, there we go. They're lining up nicely. I still think Slime Rain needs a uh, invasion meter. <laughs> but so far, so good. And obviously putting up banners is going to help a lot. Here he comes. Where is he? Alright, there he is. Hey Slime! What's up? Uh oh. This was one thing I was concerned about, not doing enough damage to him. <laughs> I was also hoping to have a lava pit set up for this fight. Um, which would have been nice. Now I'm going to hang on to my uh, potions until a bit later. Um, because yeah, we don't really need him while he's just, just hopping around casually. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -huh. Let me up. Let me up, you crazy slimes. <laughs> Alright, we're, we're just gonna YOLO through the slimes here. I'm just keep keeping King Slime on screen so I can see him if he teleports. Because if he catches me off guard, that's not pretty. Alright, picking up some of our daggers again, which is nice. Uh oh. Yeah, see, King Slime will jump through platforms to get at you. But normal slimes can't. Uh oh. Alright, ooh, nice dodge, nice dodge. Let's deal with some of these guys. Alright. Oh, here he comes. Do a platform jump. Nice. Alright, let's use a few daggers. Okay, this is the dangerous part when I get here. What we need to do... Yep. Beautiful. Okay, and now... Ah, yeah, that's what I wanted. Just to be able to jump over him a bit. Uh, oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm a little concerned, guys. We've taken a lot of damage already. Uh, 
Okay, the slime rain is finished, so if we can get rid of these extra slimes, we might be okay. Uh oh. Just getting some platforms up so I can do some grappling. Okay, yep, good. Run under the slime. Okay. <laughs> okay, we can do this. We can do this. We just gotta believe. Rufus, believe. <laughs> Believe in Slime Massacre. <laughs> oh no, he can fit underneath now. <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright. I think we've almost got him halfway. Let's plant some more platforms along here. For grapple goodness. Alright, what you gonna do? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry I went quiet. I was just focusing on the jump. <laughs> oh no, he's teleporting. Oh, 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 jump. No, no, oh, they're so damaging. Let me through! Ah. Okay, poof. <laughs> now, King Slime's probably going to teleport any moment. I think it's something like, if he can't get at you for five seconds, he teleports or something like that. Alright, beautiful, nice uh, grapple jump there. Alright, what was he down to? Oh, he's more than halfway. I might put buffs on soon, actually, for a bit more speed. Because we have the need for speed. Alright, beautiful. Uh-oh, normal slimies, normal slimies, get out of the way! <laughs> oh, have I still got any grenades? Nah. <laughs> I thought grenades would be a nice way to finish this fight. Because, yeah, we can just burst him down. It seems if you sort of stay nearer to him, you can sort of run underneath uh, when he's about to do a big jump. Whoa. Watch out! Get out of the way! Oh no, jumped into him. Oh, grappling so useful for this fight. Okay, he's under a thousand. And he's getting angry. He's getting really angry. <laughs> I don't know if slimes can get angry, but... His slimy body language is suggesting... Oh no, I threw a bomb! <laughs> oh, I think... I don't know. Grenades are throwing damage. I don't know if bombs are. Uh-oh. Uh, grappling is one way you can get through uh, knockback as well. Um, so it's a good... Oh, I blew a tree up. Uh-oh. Alright, throwing the um, buffs on now. Just because he's so quick... And he's going to teleport any moment. Yep, there he is. Ah, uh, yeah, you can actually grapple through knockback, which is... I use it against the Skeletron as well. Um, so if he if he starts head-stunning you, you can grapple away from him. Whereas normally you'd just be dead. <laughs> Alright, do, do a big jump. No, it's alright. He jumps high enough where it doesn't matter. Cool. Wow, grappling hook saving the day. What are you down to? 400? Just die already, you crazy slime. <laughs> He's like, never. Oh. For some reason, I just thought he was French. <laughs> I should take you out. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't. Oh, I missed the grapple. Uh, what's he down to? 300? Oh, shurikens for the win. <laughs> oh. Okay. We got away from him for a little bit. Oh god! What's he down to? 200? And he's getting quick! He's an angry slime! <laughs> and charging underneath, 130! Oh, oh, oh no! Those spike slimes, I can't get past them. They are... Uh, oh no! Oh no, I missed the grapple! Oh, wow! I can't believe this fight is so hard! <laughs> oh, we've almost got him! Who's got him? No! Yes! <laughs> we did it! Oh! <laughs> Hope I'm recording. <laughs> oh. I always say that when it's been like a, lo a while and something big has happened, and I'm like, did I push record? <laughs> oh. Wow. Just picking up some of our shurikens. Wow, that was unexpected and. Good use of the terrain to, you know, grapple around and dodge and all that good stuff. But we survived. Well, here's the time we've been waiting for to open up our treasure bag. 
and see what wonders are inside. So I'm not sure if you get the whole set of ninja gear out of it in Expert or you're just likely to get a few pieces. So anyway, we'll find out. Will Rufus get his first class armor set? In three, two, one, boom! Ah, oh, we got two pieces of it! <laughs> but we do get the slime hook, which I think has multiple hooks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very cool. Alright, that's alright. Um, it might be worth equipping them anyway. So we'd be losing three defense, but we'd be getting increased damage, increased crit. So they do 11, 14, or 10, 4. Okay, it's probably just... Uh, okay, the increased crit's good, I suppose. I'm not complaining. Um, so yeah, the... Yeah, the 14% critical strike's going to be nice. So, obviously that means we're going to have to fight him again. <laughs> but we know we can do it, so that's kind of cool. And we got Solidifier, and we got Royal Gel, which is really nice. So, let's see. Well, we we're just about to go underground and spelunk, so I guess that's what we'll do and get a ruby. Um, and then we can just summon him again without all the extra slimy rain business. So here we are, back down in the depths of the underground. And there's a rather evil uh, granite elemental trying to get us. But uh, if we move around, we might be okay. They usually curl up into a ball. Oh, there we go. Now you want to do it. Right. Right. Whoa. Whoa, okay, we did it. So, oh, there's some lava off to that side. You can see it on the map. But uh, we'll explore this area first. Oh, I think I can see the glow of lava underneath us. So remember, our mission down here is to collect a couple of buckets of lava. And while we're here, if we can get obsidian too, that would be nice. Oh, there's a granite golem too. Wow, this is getting a bit, a bit dangerous. But uh, there's water, and if there's water, we can just put it into the lava. So that'd be really nice. So we just need to get rid of this dude first because he's going to stop our, our special plans here. Almost got him, and shurikens are pretty cheap anyway, so... Uh, once we've got the full uh, upgraded gear, this won't be an issue anyway. Alright, oh yes, lava. Oh, look guys, it's right near. So what we need to do... Actually, what I'll do is I'll dig around first, because what we actually want is to make a little wall so all the lava doesn't drain... I mean, all the water doesn't just simply drain away. So if we mine through here first... And there we have it. We've got 126 obsidian, which is more than enough to craft our awesome new gear. So I think it's time to... Oh, phew! <laughs> I wasn't sure if I had my recoil potions. Make our way back to base. And, ah, nice. It's a nice new day. Uh, we need to craft a loom, which I think we might need to make a sawmill for first. So... Let's see here, where's the sawmill? <laughs> it's really hard to find the, the icon for the stuff I need. Alright, so we've got a, got a sawmill and we will do some base expansion soon. It's, it's about time, I think. And now we can make the loom, which is cool. And we'll put the loom on the roof of our building. Oh, it's all happening. <laughs> Alright, we'll put the loom up here for now. And then, ah, oh, we can make string too, cool. I think we need about 30 silk, so let's make that, and then you just get each piece is available. Alright, so we can make the hat, and the long coat, and the boots, and we're not doing this for the armor, even though it's 
probably stronger than the armor we've already got. We're doing it for the vanity. So now Rufus is a proper rogue. And we'll take off the um, the boots, the Hermes boots. There we go. So Rufus is a proper rogue now. He looks the part, not in his silver knight armor or his ninja gear. <laughs> He's the proper rogue. And I like it. <laughs> Very cool. And thanks as always for watching another episode of Rufus the Rogue. I've had so much fun, guys, with this new series. It's going to be so awesome. And uh, we've almost powered up. We beat the King Slime. It's been great. We've got some cool new weapons. We've got our cool new rogue outfit. So Rufus is pretty happy now. Uh, just a reminder, guys, that all our normal series are coming back. Uh, I, I got a bit into the uh, the new series and you know I think you're all enjoying it too but uh, yeah we'll start to get all of our other ones back on as well so Rufus uh, not Rufus uh, Yaren's uh, due for an episode I'm also been working on the Wolfgang special uh, which is where we're gonna get the last prism and blow up a heap of stuff and it's gonna be awesome uh, Wolfgang's looking forward to it but uh, yeah so thanks for all your support guys and all the other series starting back soon so, time for some shoutouts as always. And our first one is from Lance Allett. And they've asked me to say in a bolder voice. A bolder voice? Bolder? What does a bolder sound like? Like gravelly? If I scratch happy, maybe he will give me cookies! <laughs> oh, good. I was just thinking of like Pokemon or something, you know, like Geodude and Graveler and all that. And Golem, I think, is the last evolved form of it. So, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Lance. Our next one is from Darren Winfield, and it's Yaren and Wolfgang, and he's asked me to say in a Yaren voice, Hey Wolfgang, can I have that cookie? And Wolfgang's like, of course, I'll trade it for 50 mana potions. <laughs> but I thought Wolfgang didn't like mana potions. <laughs> Maybe he's realized he needs some. <laughs> Our next one is from, it's spelt with letters and numbers, but I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be carbonite. And they've asked me to say in a Rufus voice, I thought the boulders tasted like cookies, but it seems they tasted like pain. <laughs> oh gosh, those boulders. Oh, so bad. We didn't get squashed this episode. Yes. I just realized that. No boulder deaths. <laughs> oh, thanks, Carbonite. And next one is from Chismatic. And it must be saying to Rufus' voice, Cookies, you see? I'm down. <laughs> cool. I like it. Cookies. I'd be down for cookies. And our last one today is from the Green Scout. And, oh, they're referencing the, 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 the king of the squirrels that happened last episode. And they must be saying a squirrel voice. No! You kidnapped my king! <laughs> Which reminds me, we need to make a shrine to the golden squirrel in Rufus's base. Maybe we can put it in the underground. <laughs> oh, gosh, poor golden squirrel king. He's going to end up in an altar. Oh, fantastic. All right, guys, you know the deal. If you've enjoyed the episode, take that half a second to click the like button. It really shows me you're enjoying the content. And, yeah, it makes me feel really good. It makes me put more energy and effort into everything. Um, so it's win-win all round. Uh, keep the comments and suggestions coming, especially for the Rufus mini-series. Um, voting link is still in the description. Uh, for our next series and as always you can just request anything so I want to see this in that episode I want to see that just let me know um, And if you haven't subscribed guys click the little HD icon in the bottom right corner You won't be disappointed. You'll get our video straight to your sub box, which is awesome. And that squirrel's dead 366 damage. That's awesome <laughs> Alright guys, here's the most important part as always you will stay happy and we'll see you soon. Just as happy days signing out. See ya and that means that ectoplasm will be, yeah, getting farmed nicely. And you can see that was dead easy to set up that. So the mobs can cruise up the sides. The mimics can get in, which is one of the main things. Yeah, we've got lots of good loot. It's just... Oh, he's got 3,000 health! He's only got 3,000!